G'day, I'm Trent from Aussie Hobby Homestead. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a little frog pond at home just with materials that you might have laying around from other DIY projects. So today I'm going to be using just a little flexi tub like this. You can use any sort of tub, pot, terracotta pot, anything like that, but if it does have holes in it, you're going to need to clog that up with some sort of glue and material. Um, just a little base of a plant, feeder thing, just something to put on top afterwards these little pebbles in it so I've had these left over from another project um, I'm going to be putting these in the top here filling that up with water as well so the little frogs have somewhere to bathe during the day and at night while eating insects some piping for the frogs to stay live in so you're going to need to drill a hole in the bottom of them just so the water can seep in nice without having them float and something to hold the pipes down and hold the stand up so I'm using bricks today, but you can use anything you have laying around the house. I just happen to have some bricks laying around. So I'll get into it. First of all, I'll get the tub that we're using. Chuck some bricks in. I'll have them stand up. And just have a look for that. So as you can see, if you come over here, you can see into it, and I've just got the bricks laying there like that. So, what I'll be doing is I'll be putting this on top. I'll be placing these in here. And placing this piping all the way around. So, does it need to be exactly neat, tidy? Just have them around today, somewhere for the frogs to be able to hang out. So, I've put everything in the little tub. As you can see, I've put the bricks in here, bricks laying out, holding them in place. So with that little dish, I've put the rocks in here just to put it on top. So I'll fill this up with water now. I've put some water in the top here so that allows somewhere for them to lay. And I'll probably end up strapping some solar lights to the sides here. So at night when we do turn off the kitchen lights and that sort of stuff, the frogs that we do have on our window sills that made themselves at home, um, we'll still be able to eat the bugs that are attracted to the lights. So I'll just get to filling that up and I'll show you that. So this is the finished design. It's filled with water. So as you can see I've placed the pebbles in the top here. Filled that with water. Attached to here so that allows somewhere for the frogs to climb up onto and rest. You've also got a lily pilly I've placed in here. Um, once these grow out, these are really small. Once they grow up they'll be able to shade anything down the bottom. Um, any frogs hiding in there, anything else. I'll probably end up placing some little fish in here, depending on how the frogs do, just because we do get a lot of mosquitoes around here, and the mosquito larvae will breed in this. But you'll have them living down here in these little tubes. So if you like anything you've seen on this, if you have any comments to add, please feel free to comment down the bottom. Thanks for watching and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you.